Hey Diane, in this video I'm going to give you the 4 minute playbook on how to beat your competition, increase website traffic, and of course gain more clients. Here are the three things you need to do in order to be the best. So number one is content. Everything on your home page here is considered content. Even the pictures, right? Golden Hammer Roofing. I would switch that to, you know, Roofing Jacksonville or any other place that you serve in Florida. Just because people are searching for these things as buyer intent. They're looking for a roofing business to help them with the roof or shingles or anything else. So it's very important to focus on making your content around those keywords that people are searching for. Now, I actually went over here, put in your zip code, and I just wanted to see if you popped up on the first page. You did not, right? So I ended up picking the number one company. I don't count Home Advisor or Yelp, but these guys are prime roofing. And I wanted to see what they do, what they look like, if they're doing anything better than you. So I go to their website. Here's prime roofing. Very similar in a way to yours. Their content's not that great. I kind of like your website a little bit better, but they are doing a little something different that's creating an opportunity for Google to put them and rank them on the first page that you're not doing. So let me show you a little tool that I use. This is called Ahrefs. I pay $400 a month for it. It shows me everything Google can see. It helps me understand where your weaknesses are, where your strengths are, and what we need to focus on in order for you to get that ranking on the first page so you get a lot more business coming through the door. Now, you used to have 2,000 backlinks. I'm not sure exactly what happened, but it's been on a decline for quite some time. So now you only have 262. What's a backlink? Backlinks are like votes, not all created equal, but the better links you go out and get, the higher of an authority Google deems you, and they will rank you accordingly. For instance, you can't go to PizzaHut.com, even though it's a very high domain authority backlink, and say, you know, I'm going to put my roofing website on Pizza. You don't sell pizzas. There's no way Google would make translation between you getting credit for being on a high authoritative website. But let's say, you know, you're on Home Advisor, you're on um, a very well-known blog about roofers in your area that has a high domain rating, and we get your link on that website. Well, that powers your site. That gives you more ability for Google to say, yes, we want to rank these people higher because they're on very good websites. So that's what a backlink is. Now, these guys that we looked at Prime Roofing, I look at their statistics here, and they have over 2,000 backlinks. There are also organic keywords or ranking. Remember the keywords I said in the content we were going to discuss? You're going to do 1,500 words of content on the home page derived around keywords that people are searching for. They're ranking for 2,400 of them. You're only ranking for 254. That's another major reason why they are ranked on the first page and you are not. Now, the last thing I want to bring up on the content side on how you're getting traffic to your website, because you're not ranking for as many keywords as the competitor, and you're not ranking for as many backlinks as a competitor. You're only getting 57 people a month. If I actually look at these guys, they're ranking for 2,400 organic keywords. And they have over 2,630 backlinks. You know what that translates to? They're getting over 2,500 people a month to their website. If you, I know by all means, nobody's ever converting every single person. But I, when they come to your website, right, they're going to shop around. They might call a different roofing company. But the point is, let's just say a roofing contract is at least $1,000. That means that they're getting over $200,000 in possible revenue to their business every single month. So obviously the whole point of this video is how do you beat your competition? How do you get more business? How do you get more website traffic? This is exactly how you do it. You build better organic keywords in your content. You build better backlinks. You can catch these guys. 2,000 backlinks is nothing. You can get that done in, in about a couple months. And get even better links than they got. And also, you can copycat them. So what copycat means, whatever they have their backlinks at, we can find out exactly where the good ones are. And we, you can get your website on there too. So then you have the same power generator that they got that's going to your website. It's going to rank you even higher. But yeah, I mean, like even if they capture 10% of this, it's 20 grand a month in revenue that they're getting. It's ridiculous. And then the last thing is citations. So what's a citation? Citation is just basically anywhere that a person can find you on the internet. They're basically called NAPs. Name, address, phone number. Better Business Bureau, Yelp, yellowpages.com, Bing, uh, anywhere. Anywhere that somebody can find you on the internet, is that's what's called a citation. It's a business listing, and you want to get at least, I'd say, 350 of them because Google takes that very seriously. And when you combine the citations, the backlinks, and the content, it's really going to make a big difference. And the other thing I noticed, you guys have 30, almost five star reviews. That's incredible. Like, you know, you guys really, you should be in the map pack here. 
And when you get those citations that I'm telling you about, it's going to skyrocket you because Google does like to see very high ratings. But because you don't have the other components, you're getting ranked lower where you shouldn't be. You should be up here. That's fantastic. I wanted to say, you know, I don't really like to work with reputable companies and help them grow. So I think I think that's amazing what you guys do, and it really stands by your work. Last thing I want to show you, if you do Philadelphia SEO Consultant, okay, you hit that as a search, come down here. I'm number one on the on the internet as in far as Google search, right? I'm up here in the map pack, but I'm also number one. You see all these people with their ads? They're nowhere on the first page. You you want to do 80% of people don't go past the first page. So if I'm right here, I'm going to get a lot more opportunity for people to click on me if they're looking for what I offer. Now, for roofers, it's great because when you're on the first page, they're not going past the first page. They'll definitely click on you. But if you come to my website, this gives you everything you want to know. I did the 1,500 words of content on the home page. This is derived around keywords exactly like I showed you, Philadelphia SEO Consultant. That was one of the major words I wanted to go after, and it works because I'm ranked number one. And every sub page, you know, if I do that, every one of them, you want to have at least 500 words, and you want them around of content, and you want them around the keywords that people be searching for in that topic. So my name's Ryan. I'm the owner of Philadelphia SEO Consulting. If you want to reach me, my direct number is 215-999-8599. I would love to talk to you further about this if you want to take it to the next level or take my playbook I showed you today, start implementing it, and I promise you, you will see a great return on your business and you will see a bigger improvement on website traffic. I wish you the best. Talk to you soon. Thank you very much.